Hey everybody, how you doing? Welcome to It's Just Sharky. Today I'm going to show you a new plugin we've got on the server which is called Pazak. Pazak, I'm not sure, but it's a card game that you can play. It's a Star Wars card game actually. Someone has been cool enough to make the plugin for this. Now it might seem a bit tricky but bear with me. If you ever played Blackjack, it's essentially that, but in the Star Wars world. So we're in Tatooine at the moment. I've got my Sabat cards, as you can see, and I'm going to go and play some Pazak. Pazak with my Sabak. <laughs> I know, I know. So let's just head through zone here a minute. Uh, excuse me. Oh, it's all kicking off. Getting nighttime in Tatooine. Let's just head out here quick. I've got my other account waiting for me in the card game room. So just as you're coming up to the uh, cantina there, if you take a right here, an officer. Got anything to say? Okay. So you can see you got some uh, Sabat cards here. So in here, got my other account. So basically, this is how you play it. So I'm going to play it with my other account. So this might be a bit tricky, but I'll give it a shot. So you can play two ways. You can play a friendly way, which is essentially not going to cost you any money. Or you can play for money. So you'll play, do uh, forward slash Pazak invite the player name. And they will do Pazak accept. If you want to do it for money, you do Pazak, invite, player name, the amount you want to bet, and the word bet. Let me just sit down in my chair here. Hello. I've got my cards. Are you ready? Let's play a game. Okay, so let's play for let's play for nothing. So if I was just to do uh, forward slash Pazak, invite, player name, and it'll send an invite to that person. So if I just switch to my other account. Okay, so they've accepted, and you'll get this screen of a startup game. So what you will see here, you'll see what's on your side, the left side, and you'll see the person on the right side there. So we've got two sections. Now what you'll see in my inventory part are some numbers. Now the idea is that you have to get to 21. If you click end turn, you just go to the next person that'll be there go. And then when it comes back to you, the game will give you another number. Now what you've got here, you've got red cubes and you've got blue cubes. Now I can add a one to make up to six and if I get too close to like 20 you can start declining numbers I'll show you what I mean right so I'm gonna add a one and then I'll click end turn now it'll say it's every person's turn they've got a 10 I'll just play this on the other account my numbers in blue is a three and a four so I'm gonna add a four end turn so it comes back to me it gives me a 10 so I've got 16 now if you want to freeze at 16, you can, because you can see I can't add any more numbers I can only take away. I do not want to go any further. I'm going to be safe. I'm going to stay at 16. So that means I can stand. See so down here if you click stand. If I wanted to go further and I'll get another card next time, I'll press end turn. So I'm just going to press stand. That person's got 15. But they've got a three in their bank as well. So I'm going to add a three. So that makes 18. Now if I stand, that means the other person's won. They won that one. You see you got a little green thing there saying they won. Okay, so they've got a seven. So this time it's their turn first. So on that one, they'll just say end turn. So come to me now. So I've got a seven as well. I can't add anything because I haven't got anything. So I'll say end turn. They've got a two. They'll do end turn. I've got a 10, so I've got 17. Now, I can play safe, say stand. So they've got 14, so they're gonna wanna end turn. Got another one, so they got 15. So they're trying to beat my 17 now, you see. So they're just gonna keep clicking end turn. Five, they've got 20, so they can stand now because they've got more than me, see, on the thing there, it says what they've got. If they click stand, they've won again. Does this make sense? Let's give it one more try, okay? So so they've got four. They're gonna end their turn because they've got nothing to add. They've got no, like me, they've got no blue cubes. There's 10, I've got 10. Got nothing to add. They've got 10, they've got 14. My turn, 12, and turn. So a little battle going on here. They've got 17. I'm gonna make them stand. Oh, 22, but look, here's a good thing. I've got 22. 
I can take away two, look. Which means I'd win because I'd have 20. So let me take away two. And stand. Did you get me? So here we go again. Last game. Whoever wins this is the champion. So seven. I've got a seven. Okay, their turn. They've got a seven. My turn. Three. I've got ten. Okay. They've got six. I've got thirteen. They have seven. They're doing all right. They've got low numbers. I've got fourteen. Oh, this is a good last game. They got fourteen. I got 23, but look, I can take away stuff. But do I want to take away too low or too high? I'm going to take away 5. I'm going to play safe. That makes me got 18. End turn. So on their screen, they've got, on theirs, they've got a minus 2 and they've got a minus 4. You won't see this, but it's because I'm playing both accounts, I can see it. So they just need to take away 2. And now they're on 20, and if they stand... So I'm at 19. They won. There you go. They won the game. Now, if we were playing for money, I could have lost a lot of money then. Does that make any sense to you? You can take your money and run, although I didn't bet anything. Um, I'm going to go to the canteen and get a drink. Get myself some blue milk. Right, guys. Well, thanks for watching. And I hope that's made sense to you. If not, do leave some questions in the comments but if you've got it you got it come and play it see if you can make some money take it easy guys see ya